Okay, first up, remove these plastic clips. Right up here. I'm not gonna show the whole process, but the first up, get one of these. Get it up under there. And you pop up like that. So after you get that panel off, then you're gonna wanna hit these 10 millimeter screws. It's a 13 millimeter right there, so you remove that. Had to remove those, and we can go to the next step. So after you get those removed, I recommend remove these right here too. So you get more play in the bumper. Seven millimeter screw way up in here. Holds that together. You want to take that off. Then you want to take these other seven millimeter screws off in here too. Pretty simple. The next step, I want to come up under the car. It's two 10 millimeter screws. If I can show you, all these on. You want to get these off, like so, and then we are gonna go to the next step. Okay. Next step is you get those two. Then you come right up under here, and there's two ten millimeter, ten millimeter screws right there. You go ahead and hit those next. Next up. You got these two little tabs up in there. For some reason on this car, they were already, both of them point my finger to it. Like right there. Got to stick a flathead and pop that up. Hey, this will make the bumper come out. So, it ain't that hard to get out. You just need a long flathead, stick it up under the little plastic thing. But this car is in an accident, so I guess it was broke. Next up, let's come over to the light. Another 10 millimeter screw there. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and remove that and go to the next step. Next up, now that you remove that bolt, let's start trying to get this head light up out of here. It's another 10 millimeter bolt up in here. Can't really show it. Try my best, but. See if I can get this to focus. It's like up in there. Stick your head around the corner. Right up in there. So you can remove that. Then we're gonna go to the next step. After you get that removed, you just pull forward and the light will come out. So after you get that off, you pull this light straight out. That tab, pull it out of that little hole. Just come forward, it comes out. And you got this down here, just that plug, pretty simple, press down on it, and um, push this red tab down, and then you squeeze it, and that comes out, you squeeze it, you pull out, suede, and you want to come down here, remove uh, one, two, three, 13 millimeters, and uh, 110, then we'll go to the next step. All right, next step, gonna move that 10 millimeter bolt and that 10 millimeter bolt. So you guys get a better look. That one, and that one. And better yet, you probably gonna have to move all of these. So this one, this one, this one, probably get a long extension, and we're just gonna unbolt all them bolts, and we'll go to the next step. Next step, after you get these bolts up in there removed, it's another hidden bolt down up in there. Get my 
wrench on it. Like that. Gotta turn that off. So I'll move that bolt and go go to the next step. It's two 13 millimeter. One right here. And then one right above it. Just get your ratchet up in there. Kind of ratchet that out. Half inch, 13 millimeter. Take those out. They're pretty loose. Let me go go on to the. Well, the thing with these, my bad, is you don't got to take them all the way out. You just got to loosen them to the other fender. So you can put on. Just slides up in there. So just loosen them up. So let's loosen those two bolts up. Don't take them all the way out. And then we go on to the next step. So after you loosen those two bolts up down up in there 15 millimeter bolt right there i'm gonna ratchet that out next Let's get this kind of set up take it on out then we go on to the next step so after you get that removed then you go come here use the pry tool or something you get that up in there stick that up in there pop that on off. set that up there somewhere get it on out the way then it's a 10 millimeter bolt right there. We'll go ahead and remove that bolt and go go into the next step. So after you get that removed, gotta be kind of careful because it's gonna make this whole hood fall down. And um you're gonna want to put something up, like a pole or something, to hold it. But uh situate it. Then you're going to come here and you're going to remove this 10 millimeter bolt here. Then we're going to go to the next step. Come here, open the door. There's two 10 millimeter screws. Grab your extension set up like this. One up there, one down there. Take them two out, then we go on to the next step. So the next step, to you get them done, you can come up under the car. And it's a 13 millimeter. If I get my thing on it, right up under there. We're gonna take that off. Then we go into the next step. So after you get this off, you come up in here, and you're gonna pull these little clips off. It's one, two, three of them. Go ahead and get that removed. Oh, I'm sorry. Might be, nope, nope, it's three. So go ahead and get those removed and go go to the next step. You get them removed. Then you're gonna wanna come here. Remove this right here. I don't know what it is, but pop that on out. And come here, pop this little weird thing out. Should hold finna should just come out. So of course here gonna have to remove these. Like I said, those are T15s. You know, if you made it this far, I'm pretty sure you're somewhat mechanically inclined and you know what you're doing. So remove those, swap that back to this one, and that, that's that's pretty much gonna do it. You know, that's pretty much how you remove a headlight and a uh, driver's fender on a um, Escalade. One of the, I think it's 2018. So that's the end of the video. Subscribe. You know, we got some other cool stuff coming through. You know, but this is pretty simple stuff. I don't like to make the videos too long for y'all because, you know, a lot of you guys don't want to hear that talking crap. I, I really don't. You just want to figure out how to get the thing off. So that's pretty much how you do it. So you put it back on. Just go on to reverse steps. Just reverse the video. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out of here.